Early on Sunday morning, as the new day was dawning, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went out to visit the tomb. Suddenly there was a great earthquake, for an angel of the Lord came down from heaven, rolled aside the stone and sat on it. His countenance was like lightning, and his clothing as white as snow, and the guards shook for fear of him, and became like dead men. But the angel said to the woman, Do not be afraid, for I know that you seek Jesus who was crucified. He is not here, for he has risen. As he said, Come see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell his disciples, He has risen from the dead and is going ahead to you in Galilee. There you will see him, now I have told you. So the woman hurried away from the tomb, afraid yet filled with joy, and ran to tell his disciples. And as they went to tell the disciples, behold, Jesus met them, saying, Rejoice! So they came and held him by the feet and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brethren to go to Galilee, and there, and there they will see me. As the women were on their way, some of the guards went into the city and told the leading priests what had happened. A meeting with the elders was called and they decided to give the soldiers a large bribe. They told the soldiers, you must say Jesus' disciples came during the night while we were sleeping and they stole his body. If the governor hears about it, we'll stand up for you so you won't get in trouble. So they took the money and did as they were instructed and this saying is commonly reported among the Jews until this day. The eleven disciples travelled to Galilee, to the mountain where Jesus had directed them. When they saw him, they worshipped, but some doubted. Jesus came near and said to them, All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Go, therefore, and make disciples of all nations, baptising them in the name of the Father, Son and the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe everything I have commanded you. And remember, I am with you always to the end of the age.